Ever had those moments in life when you're suddenly empty? It's trying to be happy on your own. When you're with friends and joking around, yeah, sure, you can still laugh and smile without any inner pain. But when you're suddenly left alone with nothing but your thoughts, you start to feel tired. You're not stressed. You're not drowning in your thoughts. You've just lost your motivation. You're just tired. You don't feel happy, but you don't feel sad. You feel lost. You feel empty. Right now, that's me too. Well, it appears that we're going to have a very cheerful video today. Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to a new creative series that I'm calling Let's Write Some Songs Truly one of my more creative titles. Today we're going to delve into the world of lo-fi hip-hop. More specifically, the YouTube comments on lo-fi hip-hop videos. A realm of existence where edginess, loneliness, and depression abound, which makes for a surprisingly poetic collection of emotionally expressive writing. And what we're going to attempt to do today is to write some lyrics with the help of the YouTube comments that we're going to find in these videos. And we're going to make a nice little song with whatever we come up with. Initially, I was going to make a lo-fi hip-hop instrumentation for the song that we're going to make, but then I realized I have no idea how to do that. But what I do know how to play is this little guy right here. Oh, that sounds awful. I'm going to use the ukulele for its bright and cheerful sound to offset the dark and depressing vibes that we're going to inevitably pull from these YouTube comments. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and start the songwriting process and let's take a look at some of these YouTube comments now. So the first sad boy comments that we're going to look at is from a video called Lonely, a sad lo-fi mix by Blurred. It has 4 million views and it has a very tasteful video loop. After all, nothing screams loneliness more than a communal passing of the blunt. Youngblood says, damn, I usually want to be alone. But now, I just want to be alone with somebody. Oh, this is gonna be good. Miguel Cablao wrote three weeks ago, she said she loved me forever. I didn't know forever was so short. XX Tori says, stop checking your phone. They won't text back. Man, I feel this on a very personal level. I texted my mom three hours ago to ask if she would buy pizza for dinner and she still hasn't replied. How will I know if I'm gonna get pizza tonight? <laughs> now Aaron Carmichael says, anyone else cry? Not because there's something wrong, but you feel like life could be so much better? My life would be so much better if I knew that I was going to have pizza for dinner. <laughs> Kenjika Pons says, do you know that feeling when you're really not that sad, but just really empty? I'm feeling really empty right now because I haven't had that pizza in my s- Okay, it's- it's annoying, right? I should- I should stop with the pizza jokes. Laponsky Bibi says, Do you ever miss something you've never had? What? Were- were you expecting me to say something? I told you we're already done with the pizza j I've never had the pizza- And now Boof Off writes, Apology, bad English. When you were a club penguin gone, my friend call he saying, Club Pegan is killed dead. I saying, no, no. I cree very bad and slept. Oh man, guys, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even like writing notes at all. Like I should probably write some of this stuff down. I'm personally having a blast and I'm personally dodging all the really depressing ones because I think a lot of these are actually really funny. <laughs> Okay, let's, let's move on from that video and let's check out a different one. All right, here we have another video by the bootleg boy and it's sad lo-fi for lost souls. And the video description says, we're all just lonely souls lost between dreams and reality. Very poetic. But Et writes, I've been stuck in this weird mood where nothing really wrong, but nothing feels right either. So this is a paradox, it's a classic poetic move, where you claim two opposites at the same time, and it never makes any sense, but it always sounds very poetic. And it's very effective actually, we're going to see if we can come back and use it. Lauren G says, Does anyone else find it crazy that you can be so freaking depressed and no one around you notices? Someone, is something wrong? My head, yes, everything's wrong. The entire world and I'm stuck in the middle of it and I don't even know what I feel anymore. It's all a big emptiness that will never be filled. I can't sleep at night because there are too many thoughts running through my head. I don't feel needed or wanted. I'm just here diffing a big dark hole in the ground with no purpose whatsoever. I'm lost and I will never be found. I don't belong. I have everything but still something is missing. Everything is missing. The world messed me up so bad and I don't even know who I am anymore. Actually me. Now I'm just tired. 
well, there's your problem. But actually, I, I do feel this some way where it's really hard to find somebody who you can trust with being vulnerable with. And I understand the feeling of not being able to share what you really feel with people. And it feels like everything is so superficial and you just can't say what's on your mind. And I feel like this is a universal thing where people just find it really hard to trust people and to even look for help. Yeah, rough times, man. Carlos Ayala wrote, there's nothing sadder that living your life in automatic mode. That's how I feel lost. I feel this on a deeply spiritual level and I think I'm gonna put this in the song. Aaron's gaming show. Ooh, story time. Hey bootleg, I asked out my crush recently and I got rejected. I had been fantasizing about being with her for over a year now, but I met her in the sixth grade. She wasn't too attractive, ouch, but I loved her personality. I had a mild crush when I met her. We would write on each other's desk to talk to each other to avoid talking out loud. I thought we had our own little thing. Fate separated us, ooh, there's the melodrama, and put us into different classes so I didn't see her till the ninth grade. She was stunning. She had become an angle of elegance. Did, did he mean to say angel? I mean, out, angle could work too, I guess. Or if he was going to write angle, he could have said, hey girl, if you're an angle, you'd be less than 90 degrees because you're acute. Okay, that, that was kind of painful for me. <laughs> She was sworn by other men in the ninth grade, and she caught feelings for someone else. By the time I asked her, it was too late. I had waited too long, and her attention on me was lost. I couldn't believe it. Man, dude, it's the ninth grade, and you have so much life left ahead of you, and so much more people you will meet. It's okay. Just remember my angle pickup line, and you will find someone who will just, you know... <laughs> okay, um, I'm not putting that in the video. Ahmad Zayn writes, Imagine if all of us gathered in a small island in our vast planet so-called Earth and decided to hang out and share our thoughts for one single night and that night is now and this is our tiny little happy island. Peace. I feel like this is the way you would write in a high school essay if you needed to reach a certain amount of words So you just kept on repeating certain things and you find the stupidest way to make all your sentences longer than it should be But I can't even trash talk because I did the exact same thing when I was in high school But I kind of like that concept though like maybe the chorus that we could write for our song Like everybody just gathering in a small island to share their feelings This could be a wholesome song I think and this is a lot of potential like maybe a Let's run to an island where we can say all the things that we couldn't say, yeah. Yeah, that, that could work. And like maybe in the beginning we could like list out some of like the sad comments, I guess. I've been stuck in this weird mood where nothing feels right, but nothing feels wrong either. There's something wrong. Yes, everything is wrong, but I don't say it, I'm just tired. And then it leads into like a pre-chorus, chorus. And then we could do another few verses. Let's look at some more YouTube comments. So this one is a video called Alone With Myself, lo-fi hip hop mix by Dreamy. Another 2 million views. And this guy is, he looks very sad. I think he needs a hug. Thomas says, I don't think anyone will read this, but here we go. 450 likes and 23 replies. You feel lonely or alone because you feel like you can't talk about the problems you are facing physically and mentally. Not being able to talk about these problems isolates you in a way and makes you feel lonely. If you do feel like this, then talk to somebody. Even if they're just an imaginary person, it is so good to just let things off your chest. I feel like I can't talk to anybody, so that's what I did. I started talking to someone that wasn't there and they understood and listened. Sorry if this makes me weird or whatever. Trust me though, talking about it helps and it is scary, but bottling it up can have scary side effects. Please take care of yourself, okay? You know, I appreciate that half of these comments are actually trying to be uplifting and people actually tried to be understanding. So I appreciate there's at least some level of positivity in some of these videos. And Rexay writes 100 reasons why you should stay alive. And he actually took the time to write all of this out. And I'm very impressed. We would miss you. You are worth it. Don't let anyone, especially yourself, tell you otherwise. You are amazing. There are so many people that would miss you, including me. Being alive is just really good. Not being alive is really bad. 
Hmm. A very apt observation. Really soft pillows. Eating pizza in New York City. Eating ice cream on a hot day. Starbucks. What about food? You'll miss chocolate and all the other numb things. Eating crazy food. You can see what this guy really lives for. But I actually like the idea of singing about funny reasons to live. And I think we could actually put that in a verse or two. All right, I think we've found a sufficient amount of comments. And I think we're ready to write the song. So I think for the first verses, we're going to write about things that are making us sad. Like losing our ninth grade love to fate and then when we go into the pre-chorus we could be realizing that there are all these other people who feel the same brokenness and then when we go into the chorus we're going to sing about you know going to the island together and sharing our thoughts and then in the second verses we're going to talk about the reasons to live and then go into the pre-chorus and end with the chorus for the chords i think we're going to the key of g i really like these uh, minor seven chords and seven chords like kind of sixpence none the richer vibe So that is a G, a G major seven, a C, and whatever, whatever this is. I don't, I don't really play ukulele that much. I just play the chords that sound good. And then we could add some minors when we go into the chorus. Maybe that. Let's go to an island where we can say all the things that we could not say. Yeah, I think that works. And some of the lyrics I have so far is uh, feeling lost, feeling sad, I've gone and lost control, living life in automatic mode. But I can't stop just thinking about when the fates did separate me from my ninth grade level love. Float to an island where we can say all the things that we couldn't say and let's take time to learn how to take care of ourselves because all we've got at the end of the day is this life and I'd rather spend it by your side. And yeah, I think that's actually it for this process. And the only thing left is to perform the piece that we made and yeah, we're going to check it out. But before we get to that, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe or actually just wait until we perform the music because I guess that's the culmination of all the hard work that we just did. And if it sucks, what's the point? Oh man, I hope it doesn't suck. Anyways, that's all I got to say. I'm just going to set up my mic and we're going to get to playing. So hope you enjoy. Going to the 
top of the Eiffel Tower Listening to music on a record player It's easier said than done to remember all the reasons to live But it helps to think you're not the only lost and lonely soul Cause aren't we all just lonely souls Lost between our dreams and a cold reality So how about we just float to an island Where we can say all the things that we couldn't say Let's take time to learn how to take care of ourselves Cause all we got at the end of the day is this life And I'd rather spend it by your side yeah. I'd rather spend it by your side I took that like a million freaking times, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh. So glad it's done. High five. <laughs>